5 Medicinal Plants for Diabetes, They Really Work. According to the World Health Organization, WHO, diabetes is one of the most unappreciated causes of death. However, if it's not controlled, diabetes can cause heart disease, kidney failure, gangrene, blindness, and even death. Here, we'll give you some information you may find quite interesting, along with certain medicinal plants for diabetes. What is diabetes? Diabetes is a chronic illness that happens when the pancreas either doesn't produce enough insulin or when the body doesn't properly use the insulin it does produce. If this isn't managed, the blood ends up with too much sugar. Diabetes is classified as Type 1 when the pancreas doesn't synthesize insulin, type 2, when the body is unable to properly use insulin, gestational, during pregnancy, when there is an abnormal increase in blood glucose. Symptoms Blurry vision excessive thirst fatigue frequent need to urinate hunger weight loss. Is there a cure for diabetes? So far, science has not discovered a medication that completely cures diabetes. Currently, it can only be controlled with drugs, diet, and physical activity. The goal of these three strategies is to control blood sugar. Medicinal plants for diabetes. Nature provides us with certain medicinal plants for diabetes, the objective being to control blood sugar. However, it's important to check with a doctor to make sure there aren't any interactions with your medications. The best medicinal plants for diabetes include. Kopukai Kopukai comes from Mexico and Colombia. The bark functions as a hypoglucemic and antipyretic, among other things. How does it help fight diabetes? Well, copalchi bark contains a substance that generates glucose through hydrolysis. It helps improve the secretion of your pancreas and the metabolism of carbohydrates. Therefore, blood sugar levels go down. It is recommended for type 1 and 2 diabetes, since it helps with appetite and thirst while also lowering a fever. Here is a way to prepare it, we should warn you it tastes quite bitter. Ingredients One cup of water, 200 milliliters, one tablespoon of copalchi, 20 grams. Preparation Add the tablespoon of copalchi to the cup of water. Place in a cool spot. Let sit overnight. Then, strain and drink on an empty stomach.
चिन्मा This plant is mainly found in Asia, India in particular, in the southern tropical areas of the country. Jimma leaves lower your blood sugar and help you lose weight. Also, the aira diuretic, anti-inflammatory, and detoxifying. The aira also used for weight loss and arthritis. How do they help with diabetes? When the aira consumed, you feel less of a desire to drink sweet things, since it acts much like glucose molecules. In other words, the plant blocks sugar absorption. Therefore, it's good for both preventing and controlling diabetes. Here's how to prepare it. Ingredients. One tablespoon of jimma leaves, 15 grams, one cup of water, 200 milliliters. Preparation. Pour the water into a pot and wait until it boils. Then add the jimma leaves and let cook 10 minutes. Remove from heat and let cool a bit. Drink one or two cups a day. Eucalyptus. Eucalyptus is very well known for its ability to help with respiratory problems. However, both the fruit and leaves reduce glucose levels, as well as lowering a fever. They act as an expectorant, antiseptic, and anti-inflammatory too. Together, all of those properties help get glucose under control. Now, here's how to make it. Ingredients. Eucalyptus leaves, 30 grams, 1 cup of water, 200 milliliters. Preparation. Boil the water. Add the eucalyptus leaves, previously washed. Let simmer for 10 minutes. Serve. Cinnamon. Even though cinnamon tastes sweet, it's actually good for people with diabetes. Cinnamon comes from India. Some of its highlights include the fact that it's good for your digestion, helps get rid of gas, acts as a stimulant, and is an antiseptic. How does it help with diabetes? This plant helps stabilize sugar levels as it stimulates insulin receptors, which naturally lower the glycemic index. Here's how it's prepared. Ingredients. Two cinnamon sticks water, 200 milliliters. Preparation. Boil the water. Add the cinnamon sticks. Let steep for 10 minutes. Then serve. Stevia. Stevia is a sweetener originally from Brazil and Paraguay. The leaves lower blood sugar levels in addition to blood pressure. They are also diuretic, antibacterial, and antifungal. Amazingly, 
Despite being up to 50 times sweeter than sugar, it contains no carbohydrates. How does it fight diabetes, then? It induces beta cells, found in the pancreas, to produce insulin, thus lowering glucose levels. You can have it like this. Ingredients. Stevia leaves, 15 grams, water, 125 milliliters. Preparation. Boil the water. Add the stevia leaves. Let sit for 10 minutes. Then drink one cup a day.